Hello and welcome to this tutorial. If you're watching this video, your IT administrator has probably already equipped you with our tool today. Today is an office attendance and desk booking tool that we built in order for companies to better manage their employee experience and the hybrid work. Today is one of the Cummins features. As for the other ones, it is fully integrated with the Google Workspace environment in order for both administrators and employees to manage and use our tool more easily and efficiently. As a customer success manager for Common, I'll be guiding you through the steps of our solutions onboarding. You'll see that it's very simple and very intuitive to use our tools since they are already integrated to the Google products you already use on a daily basis. The first step of the onboarding process is to go on your Google Calendar and Gmail to make sure that your new add-on coming has been installed in your Google Workspace environment. So you just have to click on the right sidebar here and check for the add-on coming. And same thing on your email address, you'll have the same add-on. So let's start the onboarding process. Since the Google add-on can also come with a Google chatbot, We'll see that part in our Gmail section, but for now, we'll start with the add-on in our Google Calendar. So click on the common add-on inside your right sidebar and begin the onboarding process by clicking on the button Let's Go. As you can now see it on your screen, Comin is asking us our favorite location. So what we will be using today to declare our presence and book a desk, we will automatically be proposed with this favorite location to make the process even easier and quicker. So here, I'll be choosing the France headquarters, select the first floor and select an area here, the IT area, since I'm from the IT team. So as you can see, to book a presence, you will be asked three kind of locations, the building, the floor inside the building you want to go, and eventually an area that is associated to the service in which you work. So when you have selected the different information that concerns you, just click on next. As for the first step, here, Comin will ask you if you need a weekly recurrence. That means that you are able to select certain days in the week where you automatically declare your presence so you won't have to do it to just say that you will be coming to the office. And this information will be used to declare your presence during the next two weeks. And at the end of each week, you will be receiving a notification in which you can change these recurring presences. So now let's say that you need to go to the office on Tuesday, Thursday and Wednesday. So you'll just say, OK, those three days, I want to go to the office and then Comin will ask you how you want to be notified when receiving information about today, such as the check-ins, your different bookings, and the schedule you will receive at each end of week to be able to plan your next week. So here, as you can see, there are various ways of being notified, such as by email or on your phone, so you can use your mobile device to be able to answer Comin's uh, notifications. So for example, here I'll click it. Same thing for the Google Chat application. If you want to be able to use it, you'll see while onboarding that you'll have uh, five steps to follow. Go to your Gmail space, then to the chat section and click on this button plus here, then on find apps. In the search bar, you'll be able to tap come in. And then you just have to click on that chat button to install 
our Google Chat application from coming. As you can see here, this Google Chat is already interacting with us. Think about telling him hello. This way, he'll send you back information concerning this Google Chat application, such as the way you'll be, be notified in that Google Chat application and what it will be useful for, such as the check-ins, the reminders for your bookings, or the schedule at the end of the week. As you can see below, there are also other ways to be notified on today, such as a workplace by Facebook or Slack. Since we are talking right now about Google, we'll stay on this main focus. But just keep in mind that if you are also using other tools, such as Workplace by Facebook or Slack, we also offer different integrations with those tools in order to go always further in our clients' expectations. Once you'll have selected the ways of notifications you want for your today, you'll be able to click on the button next and to finally end this very long onboarding. Little joke from me, as you've been able to see it, it is really, really fast to get onboarded on Comin and to start using it. So now let's see how this works. As you might have seen it from the beginning, Comin is thought to be as simple as possible and which is why today follows the same rules. As you can see it here, there are only a few buttons because we wanted the experience to be as simple as possible. But don't get wrong, even if our tool is very simple, it's also very complete. Let's see how we can do this. As a recommendation, I would start with the colleagues list, since when your colleagues will be also using today, it will be important for all of you to see which one of you is coming to the office and on what day. So click on the button edit list, and here you'll be able to type the first name, name, or even the email address of your colleague. So here I'll say, okay, I want to work with Benjamin. Here with the autocomplete, I'll be able to add my colleague Benjamin. Then I'll be clicking on this button, add this teammate, which will result in me having the schedule of my colleague available when looking at Comin. So that means, for example, if I want to come tomorrow, when booking a presence, I'll be able to see which of my colleagues are also, uh, have also planned to come to the office on the same day. Now that we edited our teammates list, we are able to see our colleagues that are present at the office. So when we will be booking, we'll be able to do so according to them. Here, I can see that my colleague Benjamin has planned to come to the office this day and I can even click on that button to see precisely where his desk is. So here I can see that it is in friends board office, first floor in the IT area. So I'll just book a desk next to him. To do so, you just need to click on the button plan your in office days. And here you'll be able to say if now you want to go to the office or elsewhere. I could also work from home or be out of the office. But here I'll choose the work activity at the office. Then I'll be asked if I want to go all day on the morning or during the afternoon. So I'll choose all day. Also, I'll be able to choose which building I'll be coming, going to since I go to France board office. I don't need to change it. And then I want to go to the first floor to join Benjamin. So I'll just change for the first floor. And here I can see that already one seat has been taken in this floor and this area, which is surely Benjamin. So I can just keep the IT area and book my presence for this day. Now Comin will ask me if associated to my desk, I want special equipments, such as an additional screen or a mouse and keyboard, or all the ones that your administrators will have created for you. So just click on the ones you need. Here, let's say I want both, and then click on find a desk. Here, you just booked your presence and a desk associated to equipments. So you can see that your desk will be in the IT area in the board office at the first floor. So perfect, you'll be working next to your colleague. And now let's say that you want additional options, 
So you'll be clicking on Book Office Extras, which will permit you to pick from uh, a larger uh, range of options, such as a park slot. So let's say here that I want to come to the office. This can be difficult to know precisely which park slot I've booked and where I'll be able to leave my car without disturbing the rest of the company. So the interesting thing here is that when I'll be picking this extra option, I will be given a specific uh, area here, a specific park slot. And so I'll know that according to the number of my park slot, I know where I'll be able to park my car. Then if I want a locker to securely store, store my stuff when coming to the office, I can book this option. I won't be able to know which locker I booked exactly but I still know that I'll have a locker when coming to the office. Last thing, I can see that I could have booked some water too, to have a bottle of water, for example, when coming to the office. But here, there is no more available, so I'll just pick those two, and I'll be able to book those selected extras and add them to my current reservation. So now I can just go back home and make sure that I am in the area I wanted and in the floor I wanted to be able to work with my colleague Benjamin. This is perfect, so I'll have my presence and desk declared and also my office extras already booked for me. So here you can see that I'll have the park slot number two. Now that we have done this, to inform your manager that you already arrived to the office, you can check in. So the action check-in permits you to confirm your booking and to inform your manager that you are actually in the office. So you'll have both ways to do this. Either you can do it in the add-on by clicking on this button in both Calendar and Gmail. Otherwise, you can go inside your Google Chat application, which will also automatically send you uh, <clears throat> notifications about uh, your presence reservation. So when you will be receiving it, you'll have this kind of message telling you, OK, you plan to come to the office. So now please check in or uh, <clears throat> dismiss the, your, your presence. So pretty easy. Uh, either you do it on your Google Chat application from your computer or mobile device, or otherwise you do it directly inside the add-on and confirm your check-in. So this is perfect. I've just made my first reservation and checked in. Once you have booked your presence, you'll be able to locate your desk directly into Comin. So click on this button here, which will open a pop-up that gathers all the information concerning your today's reservation. So as you can see, I have booked the desk IT4 and already checked in, so I could check out from, me, from here also. I can see that indeed I am sitting next to Benjamin, so this is perfect. We'll be able to work together and I'm even able to see where he is precisely located. And then I can also see the office extras I booked, such as the park slot or the locker. And now let's say that I want to do the same thing, but without the equipment and the office extras. I just want to be seated next to Benjamin. So what I can do is check out of my actual reservation, say yes, I am leaving and say, OK, I want to come to the office today, so I'll be cancelling the first reservation and say, OK, what I want to do is just to sit next to Benjamin. So what I can do is click on this icon and then Comin will automatically place me next to Benjamin, still ask me if I need equipments, but I can here say, OK, no, what I, I don't need any, any desk or equipments. I just want to be able to work in the same area as Benjamin. Same thing, no extra needed. And so, once it's, it's done, I'll be able to say, OK, perfect. I am going to France Bordeaux office first floor. If now I want to have a desk and not only remain uh, up 
next to Benjamin, I can book a desk and say, okay, no equipment needed, just me, find me a desk. Perfect. It just find, found me a desk in the same area as Benjamin. Afterwards, when you'll have done a few reservations, you'll be able to console them by clicking on planning on your fees days and going on the different days. Otherwise, to make it more simple, we gathered all of this information inside my schedule. So just click on yours. And here you'll be able to see the different reservations you made for the next days. So as you can see here, I have a reservation, like what we could, we could call full reservation, knowing that I'm going to France Bordeaux office to the desk IT8. I could even edit it to change it or add, etc. Here, I'm just going to the second floor of the Bordeaux office without a desk. And on Friday, I can see that I'm working from home. Let's say afterwards that I'll be going to the company on Monday. So here I'll say, okay, I haven't done that yet. I need to say that on Monday, I'll be at the office and say, okay, I'll be going to the next place as usual. So first floor area IT, and then I'll be able to book a new reservation, say, okay, find me a desk, etc. And now you know the whole process. Now that you've learned how to use our add-on, let's go a bit further and see how MyComin works. So you've been able to see it just before. MyComin is a complementary pop-up that opens for certain tasks inside our add-on. So here, we, we've seen that before, you can see your reservation. So that's the home page. Then if you go to the port team planning, you'll be able to see for all of your teammates belonging to the teammates list, what are they uh, scheduled for the next week? And you'll be able to see uh, for any week. Uh, and last thing, when you'll be clicking on my office, you'll be able to set up your favorite location. So each time you'll be using come in today, you'll be able to have the same information and just to book as I did it before. And here you can also set up the recurring presences. Even if you have already set them up before during the onboarding, if you want to change them, you can still change your favorite location and your recurring presences. One last thing, if you go to the settings section, you'll be able to select the different teammates or remove them from your team, from a teammates list and then to choose which kind of notifications you want to get and eventually how you want to be integrated with Google, say, meaning that you are able to connect with your SSO. So this is it for the add-on today. We are really pleased that you are beginning to use our tool and hope that we will be talking with you very soon. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it useful and that you will be using Comin today with a lot of pleasure and interest. If you have any questions or remarks, please leave them as a comment below this video. And if you want to go further with us, don't hesitate to contact us or to join our LinkedIn community. That was Gail, Customer Success Manager for Comin, and I hope to talk with you very soon.